Good morning, everyone. Pastor Song Bei here from Lighthouse Global. Today, in our Pentecost preparation morning prophecy, um, I have a word for you, and the word is the gathering and the scattering. And I hope that the broadcast doesn't abruptly end. I've been having some Wi-Fi issues um, <laughs> as I try to manage everything. Um, so if you're, if you can watch, if you know, I'm gonna wait for some of you to come on. Um, Father, in the name of Jesus, I just pray that today's word will encourage so many. I pray for a mighty anointing and the oil of God to just flow in my space, in my life, and through the words that are spoken right now in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. I pray for encouragement as we wait for Pentecost. Tomorrow is Pentecost Sunday. Tomorrow night, I will see some of you. Um, I will see some of you tomorrow. Um, where is it? Yeah, in Los Angeles, uh, Word International Ministries in Los Angeles, tomorrow at 6 p.m. We are having a Pentecost celebration. Father, I thank you that no demon, no devil, no witch, no hex vex, no curse, no uh, whatever the devil does, nothing can hinder the move of God. I bind every demonic thing right now in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. And I just pray for a mighty rushing wind of the Holy Spirit to just blow over uh, your people right now in Jesus' name. And I just bind every demonic control, demonic manipulation, every jealous spirit, every cane spirit. We just bind it. We we cast it out in Jesus' name. When, when we just declare the fruit of the Spirit, the, the uh, anointing of the Holy Spirit, the healing of the Holy Spirit, the prophecies of the Holy Spirit, the true manifestation of the Holy Ghost of God will just come among us, even in this broadcast in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. I want you to share this video on your wall. Uh, today's word is this. The gathering and the scattering. The gathering and the scattering. So, as I was I was praying this morning, the Lord um, just gave me a vision of God gathering His people and then scattering the enemies. The Lord was gathering His people and scattering the enemies. So I declare this word over you: that God is about to gather His people. And you know, um, some of you uh, are. Um, over the summer, I believe this is what's going to happen. And even at Pentecost, the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Ask the Lord of the harvest, therefore, to send out workers into harvest his harvest field. And I really feel like there's going to be a gathering of workers. There's going to be um, a gathering of God's uh, mighty warriors in this hour. So I'm asking God for, for the... For the um, harvest God to send out workers for the harvest so father I declare right now I'm gonna do a short broadcast today I have some other things to attend to and I have to fly out to California today so kind of busy but father I pray for gathering anointing I pray that you would call your children from northeast south and west and every demonic attack that is that is uh, hindering the gathering of people gathering of saints we just bind it and father I pray that you would gather you would bring your flock together you would Assemble an army right now in Jesus' name. Call them by name and uh, show them in dreams who they are to align with. I pray for coming together of mighty warriors who are on fire for Jesus in Jesus' name. And you know, I'm super excited about Pentecost wildfire that we're setting. We're doing a series of Pentecost wildfire revivals starting on Pentecost. We will be doing series of meetings and gatherings and meetings up in, in California. Mostly we'll set California on fire. And then there are some states that God has been highlighting. So that is what we are praying for. But, you know, I am asking God that, that he would send har harvest workers because the harvest is plentiful. Do you believe that the harvest is plentiful? It is plentiful. So, Father, I pray that you would give us eyes, prophetic eyes to see that the harvest is plentiful. And, but the workers are few. So we are asking God, petitioning you to bring the workers in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. Amen and amen. And then the second part of this word is scattering. And I declare over you that God is scattering your enemies. The Lord is declaring over us that he is scattering the devil. He is scattering. He is scattering the schemes of the enemy. Those who have uh, uh, conspired against God's people, they're being scattered right now in Jesus' name. I, re I just see like a rod of, like a Moses staff just like, uh, hitting the ground and uh, creating miracles and I see like um, scattering of God's enemies right now any conspiracy any plan of the devil any uh, you know uh, backroom deals any kind of um, 
uh, you know, uh, the, the, the assembly of, of demons, really. We just scatter in Jesus' name. God's word will come against them, and the Lord will scatter your enemies, says the Lord. Uh, Psalm 68, 1, it says, May God arise, may his enemies be scattered. May his foes flee before him. So thank you, Jesus, that you are scattering the enemies right now in Jesus' name. And I pray for gathering of God's army and scattering of enemies right now in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. And I just bless what God is doing all over the world right now. That God is awakening the church. The Lord is awakening the reformers. The Lord is awakening his people. The Lord is awakening the saints right now in Jesus mighty mighty name I bless you uh, men and women of God that you will know the blessings of the Lord that God is um, gathering his people and if you've been feeling like um, you were uh, you, you couldn't quite find your tribe and I just hear the Lord saying I'm gathering you I'm connecting you there's divine connections that are coming in even as we speak I, I declare divine connections over you that you will find your tribe you will find your alignment and that God will um, scatter your enemies those who have come against you will be scattered no weapon formed against you shall prosper in jesus mighty mighty name father i thank you that you are raising our harvest workers even those who have lost their passion first love i thank you that god you are reigniting the passion in people in jesus name if you've been passionless uh god is saying that i'm re reigniting your vision reigniting your passion i'm i'm creating a wholeness in your spirit right now in jesus name so father thank you that you are creating a wholeness those of an uh, hurt those who have been wounded in battle god that you are putting their hearts together god you are reigniting our original passion of what we're called to what we are called for what we are um to do on earth what we are created for the creative purposes of the lord for each individual is coming alive god is saying i'm reigniting your passion some of you have been in depression i break it off in jesus name some of you have been depression be in depression because of the gathering of enemies against you and god is saying i'm scattering your enemies I am throwing a, a curveball to the enemy's plan, and God's plan will prevail. The Lord's plan will prevail. The harvest is plentiful, the workers are few, but God is saying that my plans will prevail. His harvest will come. The Lord's will for America will be done. I declare over America that God is about to show up big in Jesus' name. In the month of June, God says, there's a shaking that is coming. In the month of June, God says, in the midst of shaking, there will be blossoming. In the midst of shaking, there will be blooming. In the midst of shaking, there will be a uh, uh, revival of fires and fireworks all over in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. God bless you. I pray that these words will encourage you. It's a short broadcast, but I clearly heard gathering and scattering, gathering of good things and scattering of the enemy. So uh, receive this word, and I hope to see some of you in California and Los Angeles uh, tomorrow night. And also on Friday night, we have Pentecost wildfire uh, in the Valley, uh, Van Nuys, uh, in Vision Center. And then we also um, have lots of like ga small gatherings and house house meetings. And uh, we have a lot of amazing like in summer internships planned. Um, starting in mid-June, we're doing three month programs, youth discipleship program for youth kids. Um, and then we're doing um, internships and various things so um keep your eyes and ears open father i pray for the blood of jesus to cover us right now in jesus name amen god bless you bye bye